can we do a follow up on our previous analysis on gold right so real quick let me just uh, hit on gold right here come on let's go good now if you never watched the previous video kindly go and check that analysis but now you want, you want to go and uh, react to what we see what the market has been doing from monday because today is wednesday as i'm recording this joint right so real quick what if we start our analysis based of the weekly and see what position we are currently cruising at right so let me just hit this join right there correct now that's a flip screen so don't get confused i need to get everything make sure that everything is in check right so let's just have this let's just say probably that's a support level remember this is a flip screen just want to confirm the position that currently we're cruising in right okay let's remove that mm -hmm. mm. let's see what if we have a trend from that joint let's see let's see what happens if we clone it let's see so we have it right there so let's see if we bring back our chart how the market is looking like okay kind of makes sense to me mm -hmm. right so we had an impulse correction impulse all this has just been an impulse phase so there's that possibility that gold might you know go back now once we see gold you know coming back to our trend we anticipate a correction right there then we continue dropping which is going to be a good thing in a long term perspective but who knows you know gold has been uh, you know in an uptrend like crazy so let's just bring in that too and I have this right there as long as it makes sense we go for it right let's just have it right there mm -hmm. so this is what i see basically based off the weekly time frame and like i said during the previous video if um if gold breaks out uh, out of this support level now we anticipate this correction and of course we should be looking for more you know bearish property that was what we said of the previous video right so let's go to the daily time frame and understand the current market price and react to what we see basically right so zooming in maybe let's see if we can adjust this trend line of ours and see uh maybe we might have missed out some levels let's just have that right there Con correct and uh, maybe adjust this too as long as it makes sense we go for it right so that's it right so let's go like i said yesterday gold is at a very crucial level of course we had this level right there let's mark out that zone right there because that is the current market price right so at the same time there's this previous high right there so there's that potential you know head and shoulder that you know price might give us left shoulder right there ahead now we might anticipate this kind of a correction probably before we see maybe gold getting back inside this major trend right and if in any case it does that of course this is just going to be an amazing run you know continuing looking for those amazing swings right so that is based on the long time perspective so all we need to do is just understand what the market is doing around this level because for me i understand that there's that possibility that she might go back to retest this level or even maybe she might not do that she might just you know continue dropping you never know right but then to me i call all these is an impulse phase this all this is just an impulse phase so let's see h4 the market is doing right if we go with the uh with the idea that understand our price is approaching a support or resistance then let's understand what the market is doing right now let's just have that right there correct now if we look for buys right over here targeting this level that will be a pullback but then we react to what the market is doing so like i said yesterday if we see the goal has started going up we need to understand which approach the market will be going back to test this level and if you see gold giving us a bearish flag then we should be anticipating a massive drop right but then if you see gold doing this then we should be looking for other things otherwise let's go to the h1 and understand right here correct now what has the market done let's mark out uh last high 
let's mark all this let's not ignore any week right there then we go to the h1 real quick correct right there mm, now what do we see previously we had a trend so let's not forget about that if we bring in our one two right there that's it let's see if we clone it if we had a touch then let's go for it makes sense let's go flip this joint right there okay now this is based of the h1 remember this looks like a left shoulder right there head right shoulder but you never know market might be cheeky crazy you then you see oh the market is giving you something different then you react to that then the market changes its direction so we don't want to be caught up in any market madness so with that let's go right so let me see remember yesterday i said probably the market might not touch this level why because the, this trend line that we just added so gold might just do this hit this level then we, we see gold you know dropping <laughs> so right now we are at a very crucial level let's see how many pips or how many points okay that's like 2000 points so if we go to the 15 minutes let's understand what the market is doing now let's just talk about the scalpers because to me right now i think that gold is moving sideways which is not a good thing you understand i don't like this kind of market right but uh, for the scalpers let's see let's just have that right there and call it a high and of course we had a low right here and uh, what is the market doing now all right i don't understand to me i don't understand what price is doing let's just have this right here mm -hmm. let's bring in another one right there so this is what i've seen correct now like i say the market might just continue playing around this trend right there something like this until it hits this level then that that's when you might see gold dropping so if you're a scalper probably you might be looking for your entries based off these uh, we had this right here let's just have right, this right here yeah so in fact let's just remove this now don't need it right Co correct i think it makes sense so let's just extend this right and extend this too right so yeah like i said before if you're looking for your entry just base the entry of this you know trend right there because for me that's like a uh, bearish flag information before we see gold dropping probably let's just bring in these two right there mm. yeah hit 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 but i think we just need to you know look for entry right there so for me what do we see what do i see now probably this is a left shoulder head right shoulder so let's see what the one minute is doing around this zone right there let's go to the one minute now Mm -hmm. like i said left shoulder head right shoulder so what do we see now of the one minute this one looks also like a consolidating market the market is kind of moving sideways so i don't like it though but for scalpers you guys know what to do so probably a break above retest then we see gold continue doing its thing so i think this might go on for a while before we we'll get clear direction right so just do your thing add your confluence if you were gold trader but for me i'm not i'm not going to take any trade until i get clear direction and uh, you know and of course today i think i think today we have news inflation rate i believe so let's see yep we have news right here yeah i think we have news so probably let's just hope right that the news might push gold all the way up so maybe something like this then we see maybe gold hitting this level then that will be a good place now for us to see the reaction around this place because if you want to just look for sales then this should be a good level right right here right and then if you want to look for buys the same way the, le the market ma 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 must take out this high retest right there look for your entry we go up right so this is a very good level so let's just hope that news create volatility and maybe give us direction afterwards so until next time guys check out my telegram link in the description box below and adios amigos peace